Hey guys and welcome back to our channel and in today's video we're going to do just another cleanup. Um, the living room needed to get straightened up and obviously touching up the kitchen um, but the master bath or bedroom needed to really be tackled um, today. Since this, this is a small apartment and a one bedroom everything goes into the bedroom and so um, it just kind of clutters and gets messy and you guys will see that soon. Just so you guys know, that sofa or futon, it's actually a futon, it actually folds out to a bed. These kids choose to not pull it out and likes, which is so weird, they like sleeping on the floor. They like the whole camping out deal of the, what is it, the sleeping bag and just kind of rolling up and cuddling. I don't know. They're weird. They're kids. But moving on, I don't know if you guys have an entryway where if you have like a mud room or if you live in the north somewhere or even if you guys have a mud room in the south um this we don't have like i said this is not a large apartment so this is where all of our shoes go and there's so much salt that comes off of our shoes and dirt that comes off of our shoes and especially when it's raining outside our boots get really really muddy and i kind of envy a mud room right now. I would love to have a mud room because these shoes get scattered all over the place. So another reason why I'm looking forward to the bigger apartment. have yet to try a Dyson I highly 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 recommend one I absolutely love mine as you can see I've brought it up here with us um, my husband said you may want to bring your Dyson just in case because he does have a dirt devil but it plugs in and because I've gotten so used to a cordless vacuum it is really hard to go back um, the only downfall that I have with this is that the battery isn't um, it doesn't last long and um, as I would hope that it would stay charged and sometimes I think I charged or plugged it in. The battery is actually dead as you saw earlier. I had to go and plug it in. Um, but I love this vacuum and this vacuum I actually have it linked in the description box in my Amazon store. So go check it out if you are interested. This is the V6. Um, I really am wanting the V10 um, but because I'm a cheapy cheapy. Um, because of the other major things that are going on in our lives. Um, 
I'm going to wait until that vacuum goes on sale. And I think I saw it on sale at Macy's for, uh, I think it was like $2.99 or if not $300. Um, I think I may end up keeping my eye out on that and see if it stays or if it goes any less. Um, but I'm highly, I highly, highly recommend this vacuum. I love it. And um, so yeah, it's in the description box below. Now we're into the bedroom and obviously have to make the bed um, I don't know if you guys ever question yourself of when was the last time you washed your sheets and so I did this particular day I was just fixing the bed and then I thought about it and then I was like you know what no I do need to clean these sheets so after I partially made the bed is when I pull the sheets off the bed um, which is so funny because I couldn't even I didn't even remember when the last time I washed the sheets and I try to wash my sheets every weekend if not every other weekend and um, yeah you guys will see that
So here's my love-hate relationship with white furniture. I love it because it brightens up the room. It's a, especially for the style that I'm going for, the farmhouse country rustic look. It just, it's a great piece. Anything that's white's a great piece. It's a great addition to the family or to the house. But the love or the hate part of that relationship is you see everything. So I had just dusted this end table what a few days ago and because our lovely chocolate lab Hershey girl when she shakes and she scratches her hair just flies everywhere and you don't really get to see much of it on the carpet but when it lands on this end table it literally looks like you've never cleaned it and so there was so much hair so much dog hair on this end table it, it just it drives me crazy and it's it's there every single every single day I want to thank you guys for watching and if you are new to my channel uh, please consider su subscribing and sticking around and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and I hope uh, to see you guys in the next video much love and God bless